Did you know a Nobel Prize winner's invention was later used to murder millions of his own people? In 1918, Fritz Haber received the Nobel Prize for creating synthetic ammonia, revolutionizing agriculture worldwide. He was a brilliant German chemist, fiercely patriotic, willing to serve his country at any cost. During World War I, he developed chlorine gas as a weapon, personally overseeing its first battlefield deployment. His wife Clara, also a chemist, begged him to stop. When he refused, she took his service pistol and shot herself. Haber found her body the next morning, then left for the front to continue his gas warfare program. Years later, he created Zyklon A, a pesticide meant to save crops from insects. But when the Nazis rose to power, his Jewish heritage made him an enemy of the state he'd served. He fled Germany in 1933, dying in exile a year later. Meanwhile, chemists improved his Zyklon A into Zyklon B, the gas used in concentration camps. The very invention designed to preserve life became the instrument of the Holocaust. His own relatives died breathing his creation, 